My name is Ie Echa. Welcome to my vlog. In this vlog, I'll be trying to document uh, my practice of the soprano saxophone. A few years back, I used to own uh, a soprano saxophone, but I wasn't pleased with the with the sound that I was getting, the tone. So I disposed of the saxophone, and about three days ago, I got a new uh, System 54 saxophone with two necks. So my aim of this of this vlog is to be able to see um, maybe within a 30 day span how much improvement I can make in my uh, soprano playing. But I, I'm focusing more on how I can play in tune that is the intonation of the saxophone as I move up and down the register and I discovered that I have um, uh, immediately I picked up the, the soprano I discovered I had problems with the palm keys I can play till about the high uh, C sharp but if I want to go above C sharp I, I realized that it's a bit of a struggle for me so the purpose of this vlog is for me to see how much improvement I can make in that regard. And also, although I don't have too much of a difficulty playing the low notes, but uh, I also hope to stabilize, or should I say, improve upon my low notes. And one way I found out, you know, in the last three days since I had this thing, this saxophone, I've been trying to look for ways to improve on the, uh, to practice my long tones. And then, I discovered that on this Roland keyboard I have over here, if I play a note, I could sustain the note and it gives me a kind of a drone effect. And I could use that drone effect to kind of, you know, practice to stabilize my pitch on the soprano. For example, if I play this note, this is a concert C. It stays sustained, then I can... So if I want, for example, if I want to play a high D, all I need to do is to cut it, just lift my leg from the pedal, and then play a high concert C. Then. So this will help me to kind of stabilize my pitch, but also to hear, you know, to hear what is happening so that I can have a clear reference point. So um, in the next video and in subsequent videos, I'll be trying to, you know, to move from just playing a long tone or a long note to, to be able to play um, scales with a very good intonation and uh, of course that is very important with the sax with the uh, soprano saxophone so in this uh, very short lesson you know today i just picked up this, this soprano so i haven't done anything so i'll try now to just uh, do the exercise so i'll play i'll play c c concert <laughs> Got to support this this note. Maybe I need to uh, push my mouthpiece a little bit in.